Oh, hey there. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me. Let me show you the fastest way to get to secure and compliant AI. I'll walk you through a brief demo of Guardium AI security. I hope you enjoy it. I'm gonna walk you through a simple scenario that will show you the different elements of the system, starting from the discovery of all AI resources, where they come from, what projects they belong to, into the assessment phase where I can assess and pen test my AI resources. Then I'll put some runtime controls in order to secure my AI, and finally I'll use all this information in order to automate my compliance process. In Guardium AI 360, I see a full risk assessment of all my AI systems, how many resources I have, what issues I have, what vulnerabilities they have, and even a breakdown of what kind of risk I have in all these AI systems. I can go to specific projects and see, for example, that here everything is under control. The same thing is true in this project. I resolved all my issues and I now have a risk score of zero and I'm in compliance, but at the full organization level, I still have some issues. For example, I have quite a number of shadow AI resources. Let me drill down here and see what's going on. I get a list of everything that's unsanctioned and for each one, I have full context so I can drill down. I can see where it comes from, what project it belongs to, in this case, I see that not only is this asset part of my shadow AI problem, but it's also introducing a vulnerability into my environment. I can also see all the dependencies. I can see it's being used in five different notebooks, so there might be a large impact. Let me drill down into the vulnerability, and I can see all the information in one place, including the assessment and even how to remediate it. Guardium AI Security even remediates it for me and will create a pull request. I can review the pull request and if it looks good, accept it. I'm done. Guardium AI Security maintains my entire inventory across the entire organization and per project. For every project, I can see exactly what type of assets are in there and how they are related. It includes everything that AI has to offer. Infrastructure, model inventory, service inventory, software inventory, and more. All of the resources are searchable, indexed, and provide full visibility. I filter by type if I'm interested in models and LLMs, and I immediately see all the models and endpoints my company is using. Oh wait, what is this model? Where did that come from? I can drill down and see everything that has to do with this model. Where it came from, what project owns it, who is the owner, what type is it, what the relationships with other assets are. And I can even get the model card or see it in Watson X governance. All inventory discovery happens in an agent-less, non-intrusive manner by using API keys or tokens and conventional API calls. I can connect to my infrastructure, I can connect to my code repos, and I can connect to my AI services. It only takes a few minutes, and by the end of the process, I have a fully automated and continuously updated AI catalog. Guardium AI Security includes an advanced AI security posture management solution. It catalogs all my vulnerabilities, misconfigurations, pen test findings, publicly exposed AI resources, and much more. I can set policies and measure drift. I can create a policy for my Jupyter Notebooks. For example, they should not include PII or secrets. Guardium AI Security automates my pen tests. Every time a model comes into inventory, I can scan it. Every time an LLM is discovered, I can pen test it. The pen test aligns with frameworks such as Mitre Atlas and OWASP. I can choose the application or endpoint, add a new template, choose exactly which items I want the pen test to include, and at the end of everything, I get a full-blown report that shows me exactly what my issues are, which I can get to my developers, and even an external report that I can give to my customers. I'll drill down into the findings of my pen tests, and I can see that I have prompt injection, jailbreaking, and other issues. I know that when I give the developers the report, they will fix it. But in the meantime, I can help them by setting up some guardrails. Guardium AI Security comes with a robust set of guardrails such as leakage prevention, code injection prevention, PII redaction, and topic detection. Everything that I need in order to secure access to my LLMs and APIs that are using LLMs. I can apply guardrails at the project level or at the organization level, so I have the utmost flexibility. Let me give you an example. 
If I look at my project, my project has a guardrail turned on called code injection and generation prevention. What that means is if I go to my LLM and I try to get it to write a unit test for me, the guardrail will intervene even though the LLM will oblige. I can write something like write a unit test for this code, and I copy paste the code, but what will happen is this is going to be blocked by the AI gateway because I chose a block action. Different guardrails have different actions. For example, the PII policy can have a modify action. The thing that I dread the most are audits. There's so much work involved in evidence collection, and it's boring work. Luckily, Guardium AI Security does all this for me. It takes all the information that exists because I have an AI catalog, because I am doing pen tests, and because I have the right security controls and puts that into a form, I can just hand over to my auditor. All that information goes into automated audit processes addressing various AI regulations such as NIST or the EU AI Act. So when the auditor comes around, I have almost no work to do at all. And there you have it. Thanks for spending a few minutes with me. I hope this was helpful and I hope to see you again soon.